Well, we're here tonight uh, for two reasons. Uh, reason number one is to make some money. You're going to open up those pockets and those purses tonight. And we're going to have some fun. Uh, the Permanently Disabled Jockeys Fund, I think everybody here is familiar with it. It's a wonderful charity. And we're here tonight to raise some serious money for some people who seriously need it. So please be generous. <laughs> know it's a big risk every day and it, it always could be you so uh, in the back of your mind you kind of block that away but times like these we remember the guys that are permanently disabled most of them are in wheelchairs and uh, they need to be taken care of and this is one of the things that we do we, we do things all year long and actually we uh, we started donating a dollar for every horse we ride to the fund so we fund it mostly by ourselves and through fundraisers and we actually need some help too. Um, we need other parts of the industry, maybe parts of the public to even take notice and try to help us. Tonight is very important because, uh, you know, all this uh, proceeds are going to go to uh, if a jockey gets hurt or permanently disabled. Um, there's not a lot really in this industry that goes towards the, the, the benefits of, of jockeys that put their life on the line day in and day out and, and, and risk their life. Um, and if they get permanently disabled, um, there's just not much out there to, to help them feed their kids you know, put food on uh, the table, education, whatever it might be, there's just not a lot out there um, to help the jockeys. So um, this is a very important uh, foundation to be a part of. important thing is we have to take care of our jockeys and unfortunately it's a very dangerous business some guys get hurt and you know it's great to raise money for an important cause a jockey for 23 years and I always consider myself very lucky I had a lot of injuries but I was able to walk away from the game pretty healthy and I thank God every day for that and uh, 
there's some guys that unfortunately they haven't been able to do that and uh, it's just something that we need to fight for I mean we need to keep fighting for because this is such a dangerous sport a lot of people they just focus on that big races and the money that these guys pay but you know most of these guys they don't make that kind of money I mean if you count the hours they spend on the track from morning to afternoon and figure out what they make a year a lot of these guys it's not even come to minimum wage so we had we had to fight for these guys that unfortunately they ended up in that situation as a jockeys uh, you, you cannot walk you can just uh, be home and can do nothing so uh, you know it, it's kind of tough for, for them to to be able to have a, a normal life and uh, so it's very important for them to, to be able for us to 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 raise money for them and uh, get a good life for them yeah it makes the rider get together and you see the friendship on them trying to help the guys that need the help and, and the, the public's been good, the racetrack has been great, the owners, the trainers. So everybody's been cooperating on them and, and I think it's uh, eventually going to get better and better. But it's a good cause.